hello and welcome we will make some application some project in some project in python next project this project is like su supermarket if you have gone to supermarket you will know that there is on barcode scanner they scan the barcode and the item name and price or it everything is listed there and automated bill is generated a sample is here like this if we will enter barcode manually suppose i enter 100 this is a, i have already listed that product uh, behind it we will do that in either file or um, database first of all i will do this will file and then after i will make with other I will say yes and it should give me another to enter another item. I will say 1003 and this is giving me this and if I enter yes and enter more than this I have no item in this and it will say it is not listed but in supermarket this will not be happen because every product is listed in that in case the wrong bar code is scanned then it will see this and if i say no only the amount of this two one and two dollar has been added and three dollar has been made i will say i will pay here five dollar and it should print receipt here it is printing one dollar two dollar and total is three total cost is three dollar and amount i received amount that received is five dollar and they have give me two dollar return and if we have if next customer is in queue then we can say yes and neither we can quit this and restart when new customer is calm and let's go first of all we will make this barcode scanner as yes, a loop here and then we will scan product first in this video and in next video we will list that product in any values here and we can do that first of all we will make while loop here to repeat up to true let's first of all scan barcode is equal to input I will make enter barcode to scan item and this is how we can scan this now here I will make first of all I will make oh, for this loop it is giving me what is this again and again let's make here something like uh, decision barcode because we are scanning barcode i will input here do you want to continue want to add more and i will make yes or no and this sorry sorry for this i will make this here now i will make if r s t r Ba sorry decision barcode dot lower i will make it in lower form double is equal does not equal to y means rather than y it will quite here we are not concerning with other variable if they enter y and anything if rather than why it will quit this program and it should be break otherwise it should not break let's run and see it if it is break or not 
let's say we are scanning something here we are not getting it if i say yes it should scan yes it is scanning one two two if i say and yes, it should terminate as it has been terminating it is working now let's uh, define one function let's first of all we will create the file i will go to my file manager where is my file manager and i will go to where i have created this project this is not my folder here is supermarket here i will create own text file this is text document this is products dot txt here i will first list a line in a comma separated line first of all i will scan barcode i will make barcode and i will say that after that i will make something like a name first of all you know uh, there will be apple and its weight is 1 kg and price is dollar 0. Point, sorry no only 0. 0.5 we will make dollar in writing let's make 1002 this is suppose this is uh, make a this like mango it is 2 kg and it will be of let's make it a detergent suppose d t r g e n t because supermarket only not content free there may be anything this this is of 1 kg and this price is dollar 3 we are taking random value or this is floor and this is this is wheat floor wheat floor let's make it at the same place we can change this letter this is of 2 kg and this price is 1 dollar let's make only 3 product here and first of all let's describe where our file is now define find product here we will get barcode from below and let's open here first of all we have to open let's say product next is equal to we have to may open the file product is equal to open open this is only reading mode so we have to open this file called ucts products dot txt i think this is same file and let's see if it's same file products that is yes if i yes i have added it and this should give me some reason here now we should make for line in products in this file if there is a line then for if here for barcode in line if this line contained barcode then we, we have already have learned how to search in file and now we will make here i will make this product sorry i will this make product file and this also in product file and i will make product that will return us product file product is equal to none 
then i will return product is equal to product will be in form of product is equal to this product will get line that is split i will split by commas this will be a list here and we will get here if this is in now here we should return this product product and here we will get this product now i will set this item is equal to find product i will pass barcode this is how we will can find here if it item means this is it does not equal to none none then we have to add this i will define on universal list here so where i have made it here i will made global list that is cart i will make this cart is equal to list this is list now i will add this value is in the form of list if it is none then i will add this card dot append and i will append this item this item will contain all information of that item and we can use that to make this else it should print us item not listed not listed in store let's check it if it is working or not i will make 1007 because we have no item it is giving me it is not printing me this line and it is taking me directly to this let's see this file if we have file 1007 we have no file then let's see what we have done this no and it will terminate here are you not for we are not using li loop we will use if here if barcode in file let's see if it works or not 1007 Seven, yes, it is working to us. Now, first of all, we have to print here value two of that item, and I will print this value. I will print the name and something else that is. I will print. Uh, I think let's print. Print TM item. item this is a name and this is last one is price this is o it and this is in kg i will print name kg and price here when item plus i will give like this and plus sorry i you have to make this in quotation because this is variable this is not variable this is a string and i will print uh, not item items position i will print this in first position because zero position is of barcode we have already enter item i will enter second position and this is in kg plus kg and i will give this and i will pass dollar here 
dollar i will give their space to and no with this dollar because we will print that a, a with dollar tm item and i will print this of third position it will append in the cart let's print this cart also so we will track this position cart let's save it and run it find what we have we have 1001 let's print 1001 yes we have get 1001 and this and slash n here we do not need this because this is giving us with file we have to separate that we will separate that easily let's add again and i will enter 1002 if it is have s yes. we have now we have get two list this is first list and this is second list and this is a card value and this is giving us three this is how we can made the searching and i will make no if i should know then it will print in future let's we will make this we have made this attribute job and we will add this value first of all we will separate this file and we will do that Thank you for watching this video, we will meet in next video of this series.